there's, there's, there's doctrine, written doctrine, that basically says y'all have to be a certain way, be in a certain mode. Anything out of that gets labeled a certain way. You feel what I'm saying? Jezebel, harlot, different things like that. So it's like, what the fuck is the mold? You know, so you don't, you're not allowed to have your free expression. You're not allowed to have your, uh, your, uh, I don't even know what to call it. Your personality. My nigga, like, you're not even allowed to be a motherfucking person, yo. You feel me? You have to be defined by a man, whether that be your father or your husband. You feel what I'm saying? In some way, shape, form, or fashion. You feel me? So it's like, the respect factor, it's never been there. It never had to be there. You feel what I'm saying? Now, this is me speaking from the current the current uh, societal structure. I'm not speaking in, it's, it's in terms of creation. I'm not speaking in terms of divinity. I'm not speaking in terms of that shit. Because if we honor that shit, y'all are raised. Y'all were always and will always be respected and revered. You feel what I'm saying? Whether it's a matriarchal society, whether it's Ma'adian philosophy, whatever it is, y'all were always there. It was when the patriarchal shit took over. Now, before I go further, let me understand. You gotta, we gotta break the mindset of, if you're not with me, you're against me. And we have to stop trying to filter our understanding of ancient information and, and the information of our ancestral lineages to what's going on right now. When I say matriarchal, I'm not saying women rule, because they didn't. I know this, you know, it's crazy because it's like motherfuckers, oh, when the matriarchal society, the women led. No, the structure for a matriarchal society meant that you acknowledge that your lineage came from your mother. Hence why you have maternal DNA and all of that. That's how you were defined by your mother, not your father. You were not who your father was, you were who your mother was because that is the consistent DNA. That will always be the consistent DNA. The maternal lineage, it begins from the initiation of creation that goes all the way down. So that's how the matriarchal society ran, but it also ran in cohesion with both the men and the women in power. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't just, we're gonna, cause you still need, and you, you need intelligence for the intuition. You feel me? You need rationale for the emotionality. There's not just one thing. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, although, you know, we hate the patriarchal society and we wanna go back to matriarchal society, let's not take it and say, okay, we're just gonna run it because women are, no, women did not rule by themselves. They didn't, they didn't. And then when you bring up the societies of where women, um, it was just societies of women, okay, of course, if it's just societies of women, women are gonna rule. Duh, that's common sense. There's only women there. What the fuck you think is supposed to happen? But I digress, right? The purpose that I'm saying this is, is when we honored our matriarchal society, there was a balance between the two and we respected and revered the essence in which we came from, which was the mother. In all nature, it always links back to the mother, period. You know, but when unnatural beings step into the situation, that's when it shifts to the wrong side. So once that societal structure came into it, you know, patriarchy, that's when we ain't had no reason to respect y'all. And in addition to having a reason to respect y'all, y'all kind of accepted it. Because the doctrines in which y'all y'all follow the doctrines heavier than men do, and men wrote the doctrines. You feel what I'm saying? Women follow the doctrines stronger than the men that wrote the doctrines. You feel what I'm saying? And when these doctrines are against you, these doctrines basically tell you you ain't shit, bitches ain't shit, but hoes and tricks, you know? That's what said it first. Don't get it twisted. It wasn't hip hop, my nigga. It wasn't hip hop. You feel me? It's like when, when little shit can get y'all in trouble, you feel what I'm saying? That shit, it, it, it don't make no sense, you know? But I digress. I don't wanna, you know, go into that realm because that's not the topic of discussion. You feel what I'm saying? So. We all, we all take this on. We all take this mentality on because now we, we pass it on to our little girls and our sons. So this is where the, the battle comes in because it's like we, as men, we know certain unwritten codes about, you know, misogyny and shit that we follow, you know? But it's like, we don't, I ain't gonna say we don't know what's wrong. Cause we do know what's wrong with the, which, 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 which is the reason why we fall into the to the bounds of okay, my daughter is now I gotta change because nah you gonna face that karma my dude <laughs> you gonna face like you had to do that shit you had to re come to that realization with the woman you were dealing with not your daughter that karma's gonna hit and those very tears you called you gonna have to wipe them away from baby girl bro like yeah you don't you're not getting away from that.